and the Raptors with the ball. A draw off the pick from Bargnani. It's Parker with the drive. Shots good from Bargnani. Well, their plan of attack has been pretty clear to see. You get the ball inside and just take it strong to the hoop. Be dominant in the lane. Well, the defense has been very slow to adjust. I mean, that's 10 straight points now inside. Here's Farmar. He dishes it to Kobe. Five to shoot. No luck. And Toronto will come the other way. Holderon with it. Evans picks him up. Holderone dishes to Bargnani. Inside the box. And that one's good. And now a four-point left lead. He is setting this place on fire, fellas. His shooting has been off the chart. Kobe kicks to Farmer. Pass to Evans. Graham with the rebound. Graham's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Now, here's Calderon. Not a lot of room. Bosch, Walton defending. Bosch can't hit. Lakers trail by four. Clark, they've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a little bit of cotton mouth here. Dry spell for sure. And Walton kicks to Farmer. Now the dish to Kobe. Graham defending. Here's Kobe. But three. And it's Farmer. That time on the assist from Kobe. And the Raptors call time here. He did not look too happy about some of the things he saw on the court. So I would expect some changes here. I think it's the right move, quite honestly. I mean, they just didn't look sharp or at their best out there. So take the time out and give yourself a chance to regroup. A moment to check in with Doris Burke. Doris? Guys, over that break, I was able to catch the message the Raptors coach was giving to his team. He told them, this is it, fellas. Let's hit them right out of this timeout. Put some pressure on them. Show them how much you want it. Let's go get it. Guys, he's really exhorting them to give them a burst of energy. Thanks a lot, Doris. <laughs> and count it. Two points for the transfer. One more at the free throw line. <laughs> Nicely done. They just continue to dominate inside. That's ten points in a row in the lane. It's now purely here it comes. See if you can stop it. And if they continue to shoot well from the free throw line like they are, I mean, their lead is going to be pretty steady here. That's not an overstatement. They've literally not missed a single foul shot this half. So nice passing here by Los Angeles. Back to Walton. Kicks it to Kobe. Here's Brown. Chris Bosch with the rebound. Bosch has got seven rebounds in the game. Front pass the arc, but gets it to go. Bosch has got 39. He shot the ball exceptionally well as they built this lead for themselves. And Walton kicks to Parker. Back to Walton. Kobe. And there's the pass to Walton. The feed to Kobe. The three. And again, Los Angeles with a triple. You can really see that his confidence is at a high level here in this half. He didn't have a three in the first. Now Calderon. And we're about three minutes into the fourth quarter. Who kicks it to Bargnani. Some solid defense from Brown. Well, one of his issues is he's a player that just does not excel at fighting through contact on his way to the rim. Here's Rodmanovic, and there's another one for the Lakers. The Raptors have gotten four of their six shots to fall so far here in the fourth. A pretty nice efficiency there. Bargnani is screened on Kobe. Parker gets to Bargnani. And it's out of bounds. The Raptors able to retain possession here. Andrew Bynes checked in for the Lakers. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. Calderon passes the bus. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it three. He's been working some magic. 
magic out there today, guys. This lead has been largely his making. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the Raptors. Well, their passing has been picturesque, a thing of beauty in both halves. More than a few of their baskets have come off assists. And they're getting so much penetration on the defense that they're getting a lot of easy buckets as a result of breaking down that defense. Parker gets to Kobe from outside the arc. And it's Toronto with the rebound. You know, he just hasn't looked right to me. A bit out of sorts, if you will. Something's off with his mechanics. Or at least as I look at it. It's coming up big right now for this team in the fourth quarter. He's now five for six shooting. Lakers trailed by seven. And Walton kicks to Parker. He passes it to Kobe. He's against Parker. Here's Kobe. And Parker with the block. He's going to play his way right onto the bench and out of the game if he continues to shoot it like he has so far in this quarter. Feeds it to Colderon. Pulls up on the wing. Perfect on the shot. Swishes it through. It's a nine-point Raptor lead. I like the way they've played here in the first half. Just an intelligent floor game, getting good shots. The numbers certainly back that up. They're shooting a much better percentage. And Walton kicks to Brown. Passes to Parker. Back to Brown. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Parker. You just can't afford to let somebody get that good position in the paint. Well, it's more than trouble when he does catch it down there, Steve. He's never going to miss from that range. Bargnani sets the screen for Calderon. Parker kicks to Bargnani. Find him on it. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Andrea Bargnani. That's his first foul. I like this, Kevin. This is a lot better ball control from them as they really haven't had any turnover problems in a bit. Los Angeles making a switch here. Lakers trail by seven. Parker kicks to Walton. Rebound by Parker. He doesn't really scare a defense at all. You've seen him miss quite a few just like those. Trying his luck deep. Parker with it. He feeds it to Bynum. All sorts of time. Cannot hit. You know, that mid-range jump shot is not his strong suit, even when he gets a good look like that. Pass the box. And out of bounds as Los Angeles gains possession. That's a poor possession. You just give away the ball with a sloppy Peterson. pass. The Raptors making a switch here. Peterson's checked in. Los Angeles has gone two or three in the fourth quarter from long range. Good shooting so far. Now, here's Walton. Parker kicks it to Odin. The tray. It's rebounded by Peterson. Raptors leading by seven. Garbajosa guarded by Kobe. It's held in by Bynum. Lakers shooting in the fourth quarter down around 31%, not playing with as much energy here lately. Los Angeles calls timeout. They trail by seven. There's a minute 47 left here in the fourth quarter. There's a minute 47 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Back to Walton. This is to Bynum. Miskarovic is there. Shoots from the post. The shot's good from Bynum. 137 left in the fourth quarter. Bosch is screen on Parker. Outside Bosch. A rebound by the Lakers. Parker outside. He dishes it to Walton. It's Kobe Bryant on the way. And the powerful one-handed slam. 
He is an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. You know, he picks the simple one-handed stuff to get the two points. Well, Rose could be the best of two points, too, guys, in a close game like this one. Boss can't get it to go. And in Los Angeles, Gatlin's uh, shooting about 32% so far. Here's Parker on a double shot. Odin dishes to Kobe. Kobe can't get that one to fall. Toronto's gone one or two from three point range here in the fourth. And Bosch backs down. Bosch, double team. Pass to Peterson. Some nice ball movement here by the Raptors. And he was fast on the way up. Two free throws now for him. Shooting here to Toronto. Chris Bosch. He doesn't hit the first. He now throws the one they really want. He's got one more, though. That's good. Going one or two from the line. And that gives him a full court cushion. Timeout called the Lakers. They're down by four. We've got 28 seconds left in the game. Parker passes for Odin. Kobe, a three ball. It's good! And that shot brings them to within just one. Kobe has been sensational. Right side, Bosch. They're going to play on the game here with an intentional foul. They can't let them pound the ball and just milk those precious seconds away. They're going to have to hit the foul and hope for a few misses at the line. And so he drops them both. It's a three-point game. Absolutely massive free throw. That'll force them into a three-point attack. Kobe picks it to Oda. Parker outside to tie it up. Misses the three. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul. Two shots. And no good as the first free throw missing for him. We'll see if he can nail the second. He's able to hit the second one, and that gives him a four-point cushion. And the Lakers have possession. And Walton picks it to Odo. Here's the three. A bomb. And so the big win by Toronto in a tight game. Well, they don't get much more exciting than that, Clark. They sure don't. And when it was gut check time, this team kept their composure, kept their emotions in check, and got it done. Thanks for tuning in to the NBA on 2K Sports. For Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Doris Blake, this is Kevin Harlan. We'll see you next time. And now, our Jordan player of the game, Chris Bosh.